With these Pro Minute video series, Dr. Klee will share some of his secrets with you on how to become a better flutist. Hello, my name is Dr. David Klee, and welcome to another Pro Minute. Today we're going to talk about how to mic a flute. I've, I've done recording sessions from Florida all the way up here through Iowa, and uh, it never ceases to amaze me how the engineers, the recording engineers, do not know how to mic a flute. Uh, I've had them stick a mic almost up the end of the flute. I've had them here. I've had them aim one here. I've had one about six feet away, and that's how they mic'd it. Unfortunately, where does most of the sound come from the flute? It comes from right here, the blowhole. So where should the mic go? The mic should go right here. What I typically do, I set the mic about six to eight inches away from me, and I aim it just probably closer to my nose, not like this, just a little high. The reason why, that way it doesn't pick up the articulation from my air, and it doesn't pick up any air sound by being just a little high. So about six to eight inches away, <laughs> that's where I put it. And then what I have them do, I have them put an auxiliary mic about four feet away to cover uh, more of the room flute sound, I have them do that. And so between the two then, they mix that down, we get a really nice, healthy sound. What kind of mics would I recommend? I would recommend the same kind of mics you use for vocals. Uh, probably a high-end, large frame condenser mic. Uh, a lot of people think a small frame condenser pencil mic works on a flute because it seems so small. The problem is, it doesn't pick up the whole dynamic range of the flute. Uh, so it's very important, I think, you would want to use a large diaphragm uh, condenser mic. Or even a good ribbon mic would work. But you want to have it, you know, here, a secondary mic three to four feet away here to pick up the sound of the flute in the room. And I think if you try that, I think you'll, you'll find you like it. And if you want to hear what it sounds like uh, the way I've recorded myself, you can go to my website and you can check out some of the stuff I've done and see if you think, you know, you like what you've heard with how I've set the mics up on how I use these. So give it a try. I think you'd be pleasantly surprised. Thank you.